me and welcome back, I suppose. To, well, it's fantastic to see you back here. Thank you, mate. Um, how much are you relishing your, your second spell at the club? Oh, well, um, I just um, love the place, you know what I mean? I really enjoyed it. They helped me, you know, my, two seasons ago. And uh, as I said, uh, you know, uh, Warsaw will always be in my heart, you know, for what happened here. And uh, just want to do more now, basically, with this club. And uh, hopefully they will help me again and I help them. So that's the thing. You've had your first training session back. Yeah. Uh, what do you make of your new teammates? Yeah, some of them are new. Some of them are still at the same faces. But yeah, uh, boys look sharp, you know, the fitness wise and that. So. Um, it's a pre-season, you know, nobody really likes it, but we have to get it done. Professionals and uh, yeah, just, uh, you know, can't wait for the season to start and see the fans again. How much did, did linking back up with Dean Smith feature in your, in your thinking? Oh yeah, um, I kept in touch with him since I left basically and also with Richard O'Kelly and so with some of the boys. So when uh, it became clear that, uh, you know, I could uh, go or something. Uh, we kept in touch, I got in contact with him and uh, then my agent obviously did the rest and we got something done. Uh, I just want to improve here again, uh, kick on from where I left basically, so uh, I'm not really thinking that I was away, basically I was here, you know, and uh, that's what I'm thinking. So I just kick on on that and obviously uh, do better, just be more consistent to be fair, that's what, uh, that's what I need to do and uh, I'm a different player if I'm going to be that, so. He seemed to bring the best out of you a couple of seasons ago. Is it just a good fit? Is Milan Alkovic and Warsaw Football Club just a good fit for both? I have no idea. You know, you have you have some coaches that believe in you more than the others, or they give you more chances than others, and then you take them. Do you know what I mean? But I think he knows what he can get for me uh, if I'm on it, if I do what I have to do and what I can do. Um, and he he did bring the best out of me, and it was a nice environment around here as well. You know, so. Uh, I improved, you know, uh, and uh, yeah, I'm just back here and obviously, as I said, just want to kick on and uh, see where it takes me. Have you changed much as a player in the two seasons? Have you developed or the fans see the same Milan? That, that I think uh, they will see obviously the better me. I think I got uh, stronger, um, but we, we, we will see obviously when the season starts because uh, just need to like, uh, I want to like produce goals and assists and I think uh, it will help me now with the clear head and everything, you know, know what I'm doing, just uh, get my fitness up. Because last season I had no pre-season, it was a bit all over the place with the deals flying at me and uh, uh, obviously that's past now, but yeah, I'm, uh, I, all I care is about uh, how I do at Warsaw and... Um, yeah, we spent the, the, the second part of last season at Barnsley, so you know what, what League One's all about, what does it take? For you to, to reach that top six or, or that automatic spots, what, what does a team need? Consistent. You need to be consistent. Sometimes you don't even have to like, uh, you know, well, be bossing games, but you have to score and defend, be solid, and just be consistent. You know, uh, football is not uh, it's not easy, and it's not easy to score goals. But uh, that's what I think we need to do: score more and concede less, and then you know. Uh, uh, obviously, like when I was here before as well, against good teams, we we tended to like come in or be on it, uh, winning games. But against small teams, we always, uh, you know, smaller. I'm not not disrespect, but uh, we didn't like, get the results that we needed. Basically, draw or lose or something like that. So that's consistency for me is the main thing. And when if people are on it, if you got like your best players playing, you know, uh, uh, seven out of ten nearly every game and I think you're alright. Mm -hmm. You obviously contributed to the goals the last time you were here. Yeah. It's no secret that last season it was perhaps the area that we were lacking in the most. I, I suppose is that something that you're looking to contribute again this time around? Oh of course, I, I uh, love to score goals and obviously last season I didn't have the best but uh, that's obviously gone. Uh, as I said there was many things maybe behind it but I'm not like uh, you know uh, making excuses didn't happen, just didn't happen, uh, but I think obviously, I'm not saying I've lost caught many goals here, you know what I mean, but whatever happens, happens, but yeah, I'm, uh, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, if I want to move on, like with the club or on my own, like to become a better player, I need to have goals and assists, otherwise I'm just standing still. Yeah. And finally a message to the fans who, who have received you 
with open arms again. I mean, lots of interaction on social media this yeah. morning, welcoming you back. Fantastic. What, what would your message be to them? Yeah, fantastic. Uh, I'm, lo I'm, you know, loving it. I'm ready to be back. The the messages on the internet. Uh, obviously, you find so some messages that are not normal uh, than uh, the others, but uh, it's uh, it was a fantastic feeling. You know, it's like. Uh, like uh, it's happening again, do you know what I mean? Like the, it was like such a such a warm welcome back, and everybody seems like to be happy, and I feel that that gives me more, more like energy, and you know, to uh, I want to succeed, uh, and uh, I will appreciate everything, you know, like they were they were good to me before here, and I just want to like repay them back, and um, yeah. Minan, good luck for the rest of the season. Thank you very much, my friend. Cheers, Minan.